<laughs> no. Camera's off. Be careful down. Sorry. <laughs> state your... Uh, no, I just pull them over. Uh, state your name and any crew. Where you from? Hey, I'm the Funkstress. Uh, I'm from... Foster City. <laughs> you ain't from the town. I thought you know. I'm from Oakland, man. I'm from town. I'm from town. Town business. <laughs> It's I'm right over there. Hey, I never heard anybody claim Foster City, dog. <laughs> we'll start over. No, nope. hello. That's the best part of this. That is the best. I'm from the town, but I live in Foster City. <laughs> that's the neighborhood in the town. Yeah, that's 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 the other side. Yeah, that's the other side of Oakland. Tags and licenses when you roll over there. Woo! Maybe ride dirty. Yeah. I've been asking all. I've been. <laughs> I've been asking all the DJs. What was your first mixer you ever bought? First mixer you ever bought. Or you stole. I don't steal either. Um, let's see. I think my first mixer that I had was a realistic mixer. And my mixer that I bought was a Newmark 1900. What? The PPD? Yes. The Newmark 1900. Well, let me ask you about the realistic mixer. Did it have the crossfade or was it the up and down? It was the wood one, small one, up and down with the crossfade. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. It had the wood joint on yeah. there, huh? Yeah. First right. record you ever bought? When I Hear Music, Debbie Dead. Hmm. From where? Tower Records. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I was going to ask you, what's your favorite record store back in the day in the Bay? Anywhere in the Bay, San Jose, Oakland, oh, or Frisco? Star Records. I used to work at Star Records. Oh, did you? Star Records, yeah. What, what, the one on, under the bridge, but the, the, the back up? In the Fillmore. In the Fillmore? And then I came over to the San Jose store. Yeah. yeah. Where? You remember the San Jose one, right? Oh, from yeah, the Kingdom? Yeah, yeah. yeah, no, I used to go there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, High Energy or Miami Bass? <laughs> got it. That's it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, uh, That's an answer. Uh, Miami base. Did you see her twerk? Yeah, <laughs> I just I'm gonna try to get that booty bounce. <laughs> what's the, what's one of the um, most memorable gig you ever DJ or performed at? Um, I think the most memorable one was when I DJ the Paris one. At 10:15. At the upper room. Oh, the upper room. The upper wow. room. Mm -hmm. DJ for him. Oh, you did it for him? Wow. Yeah, it was, it was great. And I, I opened up for Grandmaster Flash at um, Ooh. Uh, DNA Lounge, and he gave me a list of 100 songs I could not play. Really? Before he got on, and that is where I felt that I really stepped my game up and put me in a box right. where I had to really focus. And then he didn't play none of the songs. Damn it. <laughs> you hear that, Flash? We got beef. <laughs> What's the worst? Requests you get, or, or people ask you to play. Which one that just bugs the shit out of you? Right now, it would be that oh 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 color green, so whatever that color green, <laughs> that schoolboy Q. Schoolboy Q. I don't. They ask me oh oh oh, dippy dippy yow. Converse or shell toes. I've never liked the Venus, so I'm gonna go Converse. I'm always, I'm a Nike girl. Okay. Dickies or Ben Davis? <laughs> we keeping it hood. Because you're playing a lot of the funk stuff. I know you yeah, know a lot about know, essays. Man, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I guess essays. I have to go, uh, guitar. <laughs> I had a pair of Dickies with some Mary Janes. So I'm mm. Ooh. Don't tell nobody. Mm -hmm. Okay. Four by fours or low riders? Uh, low riders. Okay. What's, uh, um, who will be your dream gig? Yeah. Something you want to do you ain't there. I want to DJ for Missy Elliott. Where? I'm going to call her and tell her. I've been kind of stalking her. <laughs> <laughs> Missy, www.pamfunction.com. Hey, you send her one of them soul readers, I think she'd be in. <laughs> she'd be all in. Hyphy or twerk? Hyphy. Yeah. 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 At least open with her. Well, she come from Foster City. Right. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Scarface, the movie, or Godfather, the movie? Okay. The iPhone or the or Samsung? I'm a Samsung Galaxy yeah. user. Yes. If there were no more DJs left, and you had to pick from these two DJs to DJ your birthday party, who would you pick? Grandmaster J or Paris Hilton? <laughs> 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 Gotta answer that. You can't plead the fifth. I need an answer. Who's Grandmaster J? Exactly my point. <laughs> 
take Grandmaster Jay without even knowing who he is. <laughs> <laughs> you say you do. Paris can't hook you up? Paris can't do nothing for me. Okay. Give me some money. <laughs> <laughs> he was the imitator who did the, the Beams commercial using. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, still, I won't take Paris. <laughs> I got I got to ask you this. Um, Cameron Paul or Michael Erickson? Ooh, you Michael make sure. Erickson, because I'm the female Michael Erickson. Okay. I feel I got his style. I love his style. Uh, nothing wrong with Cameron Paul. Cameron Paul had his own style. They had two different styles. Yep. You know, it was it was more like you know, uh, Michael Erickson was more on the urban side. Cameron was more of the '94 '9 types, right. the electro, the, 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 the club music, the club right. music. Right. But he also was able to do both. Right. And I just feel that um, Michael Erickson's style was just so notorious and just so smooth. Mm -hmm. Just, from, just, just blends were ridiculous. Mix it. Uh, I remember when they used to broadcast live from Deja Vu. You can uh, hear his mixes. Oh, yeah. Deja Vu. I want to just thinking about that. I want to ask him about those records that he played. Yeah. Right? Yeah. One more, one more, one more, one more. I was going to ask you. Get over While there. he's getting the question, Get tell us there. what's in the Soul Rito. Soul Rito has uh, fried chicken, mac and cheese, collard greens, and a splash of yams. Your top five records, we'll, we'll leave you at that. Any era? Any, any era, any genre. You always got to keep with you. This, every, you know, these are your records. This is songs that people know when they go to a Pam's party, they're going to hear these tracks and they're yours. You're going to hear Encore from Cheryl Lynn. Yeah. You're going to hear um, Cameo. I guess I'll, I'll break it down and just say um, uh, Single Life, mm. Cameo. Um, as far as, you know, Snoop Dogg, I do play him in just various different songs. You'll definitely hear me play Jay-Z, like I did today. Uh, that's like one of my favorite songs. And I guess, let's see, who else would I play? Um, anything Rick James. I can't, I, I guess too, I can't, I can't, I can't that's five songs. All right, thank you so much for hanging out with us. <laughs>